welcome back to my channel so as you guys see from the title this is going to be a car tour you guys are like you have a car well if you have been watching my vlogs which you should be i'm gonna link it right up here i bought a tesla model 3 standard range like almost a month ago and that's the one right behind me so this past month or two i have been really trying to just organize the car keep the car clean buy all the things that you might need for your car that just can be accessible and you kind of feel like it's your own car and i am so proud of what i have done with my sister who she's recording right now that i want to show you guys and give you guys some tips if you're planning on getting a new car or getting new tesla it doesn't matter i feel like some of these things are kind of like some are specific to Tesla, but some are also specific for any car that you can use and I feel like that will be helpful for you guys. So without further ado, let's get started. So I already have the app on my phone. It's going to open it for me, you guys see. And now let's start on the driver's side. So first thing you're gonna see here, this is my cute tiny trash can. They call it, te I don't know, like a cyber can or something like that. It's very cute, it looks like cyber truck style, but it fits perfectly right over here into this compartment and it doesn't like take so much space but also it doesn't like you cannot put so much but it's perfect if you have like I don't know some random things that you need from like straws or paper stuff like I don't know some random things and it just closes so easily it just push and fits perfectly now let's get inside so moving from there first thing in here is something on my sun visor and if my sister recommended this so if you guys are not familiar you know in tesla you don't have these regular vents they're kind of like invisible so you can't really stick anything for the smell of your car scent so this is a car fragrance from bath and body works and would 100 percent recommend it you just stick it to your windshield i mean windshield sun visor right over here and you can get like three different fragrances for like maybe ten dollars and you can just buy this too and this one kind of matches perfectly with here i would recommend it it smells so refreshing and there are so many things that you can buy from there bath and body works has so much good stuff anyways we just recommend it and it just fits perfectly right here kind of reminds me of like a garage opener which i don't have it so it's great now let's move on to center console so right here let's open it before this this was a giant space it was like empty like this and I feel like it's like less use of space and I'm gonna link this down in the links that this is this place that you can put this console in here it's like a drawer but this doesn't come with the car and I have used this like put some of my stuff here it's my uh, like monthly parking thing this is like my um, gum this is Hermes little bit fragrance <laughs> and most importantly hand sanitizer because everyone is dirty these days you never know right and the best part is then you can move this around this is my straws metal straws this is some stuff that you can like dust proof and like clean it and this is the best purchase <laughs> you park like an idiot you can put this in places literally just spread it and in the back of it you can choose a reason why they did it <laughs> by you putting it and just put it there I feel like it's kind of a good way to get the stress out it's kind of fun I would say that now let's move on to armrest this part is also my favorite part too because this part also didn't have that much of an organization it was just let me see if I can move it it was just this before again L not really great way to use the space hence I bought this it comes together actually so you can put some things in here like wet wipes more wipes for your hands some napkins that I stole from somewhere I don't remember <laughs> and uh, these are just basic napkins for your uh, actually for your nose and stuff you know winter is coming these are alcohol wipes sometimes i also use it for these seats because it's, it gets dirty sometimes depending because you guys know i'm a skincare fan and if you sweat and you feel like your skin is so oily i would recommend using these charcoal sheets they are so great and this is from bosha i love this brand i have some basic sticky notes in case you need to write something this is the pen for it and that just pretty much wraps up what is over here now this is the glove compartment so this one you can also organize Organize it too they have dividers but I don't have that much stuff so basic stuff some registration stuff is there which I'm not gonna show but these are some extra napkins this is a first aid kit because you never know what you're gonna need and these are some extra scents that I was just mentioning from Bath and Body Works that you can refill it it just comes so easily then close it now let's move on to the back okay now let's open it I love that it's an automatic trunk so that comes convenient so first thing you see here and actually these ones I just usually stick it right over here and it sticks perfectly because it's like very kind of like a cute nook 
In here, I have a few things. This one is Dawn dish soap. For what? I know you guys are gonna laugh, but this is not just for dishes. Because I have white seeds, and they're not like regular like leather. They are like vegan leather, but you still need to clean them. And these work, work perfectly. They're so easy, and you can just use microfiber cloth very easily. But for the outside of the car, again, I will probably get it car washed. I know it's dusty. But you can get these uh, speed wipe from Chemical Guys. This is also available on Amazon. Another microfiber glass, you can use it for the outside of your car. And this one smells raspberry, not a huge fan, but they do the job, would recommend it. And lastly, this is the part that I have to try it and I haven't used it so much. This is called Leather Shield. So this is for the white seats that you have to use. It's kind of like a ceramic coating, kind of like that. Because leather over time gets this like wrinkles and stuff, it end up looking old this kind of gives a shine over time and protects it some more and that's why i'm going to try it it was a bit pricey and it was like 50 dollars or something but everyone has bought it and i would recommend it if you have leather seats now let's move on to here i have umbrella because you never know if you live in east coast you know weather is so unpredictable even in the summer it's either raining one day or like in the morning then it's just sunny the next day or like next hour so you're gonna need an umbrella then I also have this, essentially, it's not even a blanket, it's kind of, is it kind of like a blanket? You will say that, right? Yeah, it's kind of like a blanket, uh, or like if you are eating something, or if you just come back from the beach or something, and there's so much, I don't know, you're wet or something, and you don't want to sit in your seat, I feel like, like you can use this, you can just cover it. I think it's from Delta. <laughs> I saw it. And last thing in here, this is my charging cable from Tesla, and I love it because this bottom of it is Velcro, and it's just really stops right over here that i don't even have to worry about sliding around and let me just show you guys real quick um the charging so you guys will see so this is the regular charger you can use and this is the adapter for j17 and this is the for wall that you can use and that just pretty much wraps it up now let me close these up and i'll show you guys last thing which are the mats okay now we are going to the back and i want to show you guys the floor mats so, in case you guys don't know, if you buy a standard range Model 3, not the performance one, it doesn't come with the floor mats, so you kind of have to take care of yourself. And it's so funny, because as soon as I bought them, and I posted about my delivery experience, there were companies literally reaching out to me, I was telling this to my sister, they're like, oh, they're like, can you review this? Can you review this floor mat? So I was like, I already bought it, so it's fine. But, if you don't want to spend too much money, because they are about like, starting from like 100 something, then it goes up to $200, and some of them also have mats for like the trunk and the frunk, which I'm gonna show you guys at the end, because there's not much in it. You can just have something for the back seat and the front seats, like the passenger and the driver. That was, I think, about $70 or something. And so far it has been working great for me. It's like not slippery at all because there's like something from a 3D Stripe or 3D brand. That one is very slippery and, and I had it when I was in the rental in Denver. I did not like it. These are just plastic. If you come closer, you'll see. They're plastic and they kind of like have nooks around it. So like even there's dirt in it, it's very easy to clean because it's just plastic. There's not much in it. and. But it has also all these like depth to it that like if there's some sort of dirt it's going to pick it up very easily i uh, would just recommend it it hasn't been that long that i would say how durable they are but so far it's been working fine now let me show you guys the front of it too this is the driver's side ignore i'm a messy messy driver <laughs> but yeah you guys see it fits very perfectly i feel like if you wouldn't see it like if you didn't know it looks like it comes from the factory, so that's what I would say. It looks way worse in person, <laughs> but in camera it looks less likely. But now let's go into the, let me show you guys the passenger side. It also looks very similar. Then I can show you guys the trunk. Yeah, so the passenger side is like this. This one is like a bit like squishy, like it's not fully in place, but I think it's just gonna take over time. But still very happy about it and it looks very clean. Now let me open the front, or they call it front so i have to go into my app and press it unlike the uh, trunk it's actually not automatic it just opens pop like this but then you have to put it yourself you guys see there's not much in it i have some bag in here some people actually put their chargers here 
but I use this space because it's covered. I can put my bag and stuff and it just comes very easily. That's a toe hitch, I think. Um, and this is a washer fluid that you can use it, which I think I will be fine for now. But other than that, that kind of wraps up the car tour. So I hope you guys like this video. And if you do, please don't forget to get a thumbs up and I will put all the links down below. And they're pretty like affordable, I would say. All of this total was definitely less than $200. And I would 100% recommend it because they come in so handy and you're gonna have the best experience in your new car.